Hey, good morning, guys. This is Frederick. Uh, this is uh, June 17, 2017, it's 7.40 in the morning. I'm supposed to go into Cuba, Havana today. But yesterday, President Trump just posted some weary restriction. I don't know whether it's gonna be affect my trip or not. We gotta figure it out. Now on a Monday out train, I'm going to the Terminal 4, Flowers Delta. You can see the weather outside, it's very cloudy, just like my moon. Yeah, I'm very concerned about what's going on. Because I was planning to go to Cuba um, for a week as my very first trip to Cuba. And I booked actually three months ago until yesterday. I was, um, I saw some, I saw the, uh, the press conference uh, on YouTube and the President Trump is going to uh, overrule uh, the President Obama's uh, policy like uh, um, to uh, reconnect the relationship with Cuba. So now he posts a new restriction on traveling and a business. Uh, I tried to find any information on the airline, but uh, nothing else showed up. And uh, I was still able to check in. Uh, so we're gonna figure it out whether I'm going to Cuba or not. Also for the people who are ready for uh, the trip also, they are planning a trip to Cuba. Now they're concerned about the new policy. So we're really gonna be figured out. All right guys. I'll find the answer. Do the checking here. Um, insert a car. Okay, let's see. Follow your step down, please. Oh, it's not working. No, it's not working. I'm gonna ask him with my car. Okay, oh, okay guys, it's Frederick. Very good news. And I talked to the, the airline guy and uh, you know the checking guy they always tell me, you know, yeah everybody don't know yet. There's no new regulation has been posted to the Delta Airline. I got my boarding pass, you guys can see. Very nice boarding pass. I'm going to Cuba and also you are able to purchase a $50 a visa you have to really be careful if you feel it wrong you pay another fifty dollar if you you messed up on the fly you don't get into the cuba that's how i understand that's why the uh the lady told me to be really really careful to fill those things out so okay i'm going to check in i think i'm a little late i'll talk to you guys in the lounge all right hey guys i'm in the terminal it's all checking everything is good it just takes me a few minutes i have my drone my gopro i have to put it in all my backpack it's annoying, but uh, it works it, right? They allow me to take it. I can take some drone footage, I can take some motion footage, and also this giant camera. And now I'm going to find where is my launch. Yeah, I only will be there like for 40 minutes. The, the fly is going to boarding, all right? Let's go find where is my launch. So I'm going to this launch wingtips, but I know it's very, very bad comments and some stuff like that. The door is super small. Let's see the inside, alright? Let's see the inside. Yeah. 
it seems so far so good. Um, um, this is the wing tip launch in German of four, which the food is pretty mediocre. They have champagne and orange juice. I can make my own mimosa. Cheers. Oh, I saw the food selection for breakfast. I was really disappointed. Thank you. I see the food loaves. Really good. I'm gonna just drop a little. <sighs> okay, I'm going to have about 15 minutes. I'm going to head to Cuba. And again, I'm waiting for the boarding. Actually, it's past 9.05. It's supposed to start boarding. But I didn't see anybody yet. Oh, there might be the crew. I don't know. But so far, I haven't heard anything about canceling the fly. So far, I haven't heard anything about it. The new policy by President Trump into effect that the current airline uh, you know, scheduled to Cuba. So, so far, so good. And nothing I'm a little worried about it now is how can I come back? I don't know. If you didn't allow me directly from Havana back to JFK by Delta, I probably take another flight to somewhere nearby, like a Mexico City. Then yeah, got another flight back to JFK. So we gotta figure it out. So I'm going to talk about my trip a little bit. So it's my very first trip to Cuba. I have no idea what's gonna happen. I find some sign, I have some idea where I want to go, but I haven't have any very detailed schedule. So, also my Spanish is really bad, so yeah, I'm gonna figure it out, that's how I understand that. Uh, I've been traveling around the world a lot, but this is my very, very first vlog. I just purchased the Canon 70D, start my vlogging, and I'm going to start and learn how to edit the videos. So, yeah, so this trip I will show you guys about how an unplanned guy, an unorganized guy, travel around the world by himself. Um, so let me talk about the flight tickets. So the flight tickets I booked about three months ago is about two hundred eighty dollars-ish, and that includes the uh, medical insurance and some other fees charged by Cuba government. Also, you have to purchase a visa. I'm going to show you guys um, the tourist visa to Cuba. So you got to pay fifty dollar. Uh, for Del to Delta, but some other airline I think the price varies, but I think uh, maybe 30 to 50 dollars you can get one So you fill that out and then you go to Cuba. You just give them your visa and your passport. That's it Thank you <sighs> Okay I think I'm the very first person on board. Let's see what's gonna be happening today. Very, very. Oh, I saw the game. Yeah, very scary. It's 1D, right? 1D, yes. Yeah, so we'll yeah, I just bought it. And it looks like it's a really nice flying. And that's the first class seat, which is domestic. You don't think about it, you can lay down. 
<sighs> so it's three hour flying, as you know. Oh, the window handle is a little stick in here. Oh. Edinburgh grip. How do I think I'm gonna be Oh man, I'm so happy those people on that fly. That looks a very nice fly, right? Especially you can see the backs of the way. Connecting flies, yeah. You have to go All the right there. Oh. Crazy. Hey. Look sign, man. Look sign. Yeah, you guys see, right? Connecting fly. I'm not connecting to somewhere. The sign is so confusing. Wow. Guys, see the Chinese brand here? That's out from here. Wow. It's been so popular. Ah. Wow, I look here to me. This thing feels so dark. It feels like you're going to, you know, I, I can tell. You know, it's very, very weird feeling. 
I don't know where is that? We didn't figure it out. I don't know if we figure it out. I think we have to figure out the forms. Right here. Oh, that's a costume. Uh, hello everybody, Freddy back. I'm stuck at the airport. I don't know why somehow they go through the x-ray, they find that there's a drone there. I don't know what's going on. They asked me to go through the custom to declare the tax. And uh, yeah, it's kind of like a weird process. And several people ask me about my address, my name, what do I do, blah, blah. But I still have my drone right here, which is really, really important. I don't know whether they want to ask me to pay, but I saw some people get it, the drone, before. Nothing happened. I'm the lucky one or something, they changed the policy. Maybe people fly drone too much in here. So, I think it's valuable listen for maybe future coming drone pilots to get something here. I still have like four or five people in front of me. The, the process is really, really slow. And Hopefully they'll give me the drone and then charge me for the tax because I don't have a lot of cash on me and the credit card, American credit card doesn't work here at all. So I wish me best luck. I'll keep you guys updated for any drone pilot who wants to bring the drone to Cuba after June 18th, 2017. Some just left the airport. It's like four hours later. I got a bet, as I already told you. They took my drone. I now only have my camera and my GoPro with me. So that's the elbow, you can see all the taxi. I'm going to get the money first, then I'm going to take the taxi to the city. Okay guys, that's the balcony of my hostel. Let's see our kitchen. That's the reception area. This is our the menu de comida. So we have chicken, we have uh, vegan meal, we have lobster, which is my favorite, and we have a shrimp. They'll come in rice and beans, which is only six cook, six dollars. And this is our kitchen menu. Sorry, kill me. Very nice. This is our famous chef here. Very nice. Hola. Hola. Very nice. Oh, I'm so hungry. I smell yeah, the food. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah.